The Science of Getting Rich There is a thinking stuff from which all things are made and which, in its original state, permeates, penetrates, and fills the interspaces of the universe. A thought in this substance produces the thing that is imaged by the thought. You can form things in your thought, and by impressing your thought upon formless substance, can cause the thing you think about to be created. In order to do this, you must pass from the competitive to the creative mind. Otherwise, you cannot be in harmony with the formless intelligence, which is always creative and never competitive in spirit. You can come into full harmony with the formless substance by entertaining a lively and sincere sense of gratitude for the blessings it bestows upon you. Gratitude unifies your mind with the thinking mind so that your thoughts are received by the formless substance. You can remain on the creative plane only by uniting yourself with the formless intelligence through a deep and continuous feeling of gratitude. You must form a clear and definite mental image of the things you wish to have, do, or become. And you must hold this mental image in your thoughts while being deeply grateful to the Supreme Power for granting you all of your desires. You who wish to get rich must spend your leisure hours in contemplating your vision and in earnest thanksgiving that this reality is being given to you. Too much stress cannot be laid on the importance of frequent contemplation of the mental image, coupled with unwavering faith and devout gratitude. This is the process by which the impression is given to the formless substance and the creative forces set in motion. The creative energy works through the established channels of natural growth and through present industrial and social order. All that is included in your mental image will surely be brought to you who follow these instructions and whose faith does not waver. What you want will come to you through the ways of established trade and commerce. You must be active in order to receive your own when it is ready to come to you. You must more than fill your present place. You must keep in mind the purpose is to get rich through realization of your mental image. You must do every day all that can be done that day, taking care to do each act in a successful manner. You must give to every person a use value in excess of the cash value you receive so that each transaction makes for more life. And you must hold the advancing thought so that the impression of increase will be communicated to all with whom you come in contact with. You who practice the foregoing instructions will certainly get rich. And the riches you receive will be in exact proportion to the definiteness of your vision, the fixity of your purpose, the steadiness of your faith, and the depth of your gratitude. This is the science of getting rich.